Good evening everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jellybean and we are back today playing U4 as Byzantium. Um, currently in the middle of a war against uh, Great Britain that France started. Um, Sweden, Venice and stuff are all in the war as well. Um, I'm just trying to th think here. We've got our armies built back up since we lost two of them last uh, last episode against Venice, and I'm wondering if now is a good time to go to war against uh, oh, fucking Spain joins and never mind. I was gonna say I wonder if now is a good time to go to war against Poland, but but with Spain joining, no, it's not uh, not a good time at all. So we are not going to do that. Instead, I guess we're going to just keep focusing on Venice here. Uh, get you marching up here. Cool. I want to keep an eye on this, make sure that we don't, uh, don't miss out on our opportunity to get innovativeness. Boy, rat ended that. I don't care. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I guess we can get these 13. Unfortunately, we didn't actually capture any more light ships there, but pull you off. Do I need to upgrade you at all? Let me check. No. And now let's come blockade Venice. And. All right, cool. Wanted to make sure our autonomous uh, converting was still on. Go there now. Go there we go. Um, I guess we can finish this and then I'll probably just come sit somewhere and keep uh, keep drilling. I'm gonna have to move these Maltese. Or, uh, move this army to Malta. Let's start that now, I guess. Where is Venice's... They've only got 18 ships. So this is their entire navy, so... I don't care, then. The rest of these guys are all fine. Um, you. Protect trade in Alexandria. And... Go to port during war. So that way they can meet up with, uh... Moose 10 Diplo. That way they can meet up with the other army, uh, or, uh, navy that we've got protecting trade in Alexandria after the, after the war. Keep drilling. I'm not gonna drill with you guys. Come on. There we go. And with that siege over, let's go to Zagreb. And start drilling. 80% still there. How many? Can't have very much more here, unfortunately. Um, printing press gives benefits. All right. So. Admiral died. It looks like an admiral that we weren't using so that's fine the economy we're still good there we're making a hundred five ducats per month oh yeah um okay then uh duh, duh, duh. we should probably just develop stuff then um what do we What do we develop? Let's, I guess, just look here. Production value. Right here. Okay. It's in the state, so that's fine. Let's, uh... Encourage development then, 
and good all right i was afraid that i fucked something up there for a second but i didn't 1148 yeah we're good once we get closer to Go down to speed three. I think we're good. Save ten percent on Miltech. Still get the uh Um innovativeness from it, so Bohemia wants an alliance. Who are your rivals? Austria, Switzerland, Poland. I wonder, I, uh, I kind of think I should get this back. It's 44,000 troops that would help. Presumably against Poland, maybe against France and stuff later. Yeah, I'm going to get Bohemia back as an ally. Shouldn't cause issues and it doesn't. Um, diplomacy, go back to outreach countries with him, I don't know how long he's going to stay improving, but whatever. Saxony is the new HRE emperor, interesting. Spain declared war in Tunis, unfortunately. Conversion successful in Marash. Oh shit, they give me a bunch of land. I don't know, like... Okay, I'm glad that we were able to do that, but... Eesh. Aggressive expansion was already an issue. And I'm afraid it's just going to get worse now. They give me Trias. Holy f fuck. Um, okay, I guess they gave me this, which gives me some more permanent claims. And stuff. We need 18 provinces here now. Fuck. I guess let's core stuff up. That's not good though. Just for shits and giggles, let's reset everybody hopefully. Hopefully that works out. Hey, we just inherited Kiev. Fuck yeah, let's go. Got a thousand here that we're going to get rid of. We've got 3,000 here we're going to get rid of. And then this 13,000. Maybe we'll keep and try to turn into something it is putting us over a force limit but i don't think i care we can stay there that's fine we get another oh we did get another uh missionary it's got to be from from what hmm not institutions which one is it your projects Oh, I figured it was from, oops, Kiev itself, but apparently not. Piss off, Saxony, I don't give a shit about you. You could repair the Theodosian walls. And, I mean, it's not a terrible idea. Let's march you down here. Although I want to make sure... I want to make sure we actually keep these upgraded. What level forts do we have available to us? 
just level four. That's what I thought. With Martian accepted peace. Oh, we've got Croatian separatists now as well. I really want to just take these. I really just want to take these rebels out, but I can't do anything while we're in this war. Still carrying favors with France. Scotland looks like Scotland peace out then. It's 24. Just with the Mamluks just ended. So I wonder if we should go to war with them then. Who joins it? Them. Persia, Venice, Medina, Kilwas, Safala. Bohemia would join. Why wouldn't Russia? Oh. Because they're because they're thirty five hundred ducats in debt. You know, I really wouldn't mind getting Russia in a PU. Try to keep an eye on them, I suppose. Because there's a chance. There's a chance that we're able to get them in a PU at some point. Um, and the other rebels knew. No. What do we need to embrace? Global trade. Crimea. Um, alright, let's try to dev for Crimea then. Encourage development. Or dev for global trade in Crimea, excuse me. Um. Let's start with this. It's pretty close, but not close enough. There we go. That helps. Now 2,700 to embrace it. Does it pay to wait? Maybe. Yeah, let's not embrace it. I think it'll make more sense to just wait. This general died... Good thing we have another one. Because I just spent all of my mill points. Um, well, since we know that it's going to cost 2700 Am I building something here? Ah, oh, that's right. I was building a, a fort. Because I need to upgrade the Hagia Sophia. To level 3. And I believe that's for a mission. I also want to upgrade this here. Cost a thousand. Guess we can. Since we're making 71 ducats per month. Can we please hurry up? And finish this though. No ships that need to be upgraded there, that's good. Sweden just pieced out. Um, disputed succession. Fourteen thousand. Meh. Uh, no. I'm pretty sure it said an advisor was leaving. Um, I think this guy's half off, so I guess we can take him. About time that the army or that the rebels in Malta spawned. God damn. 
Let's move you guys to Epirus, I suppose. It's fine. Here comes Greek. Cool. But Evs. Twenty-seven. I think it was twenty-seven, like seventeen or something before. Now it's thirty-five. Which honestly is probably fine because some of these shouldn't take. Let's see, some of these shouldn't take too long. But I lied; <laughs> they're taking a while. Um, we're almost done with the fort in Constantinople. And then we can start upgrading the uh, the Hagia Sophia. June first, and then we'll. Uh, There we go. Alright, let's start upgrading that. We can core up Spoleto now. Croatian Serrani. Where are these Serrani separatists? Right here. Oh, hopefully we can get out of this war soon. That way we can... Uh, actually deal with these rebels if we became defender of the faith we get a missionary monthly war exhaustion yearly prestige and maintenance cost I don't that doesn't matter to me at all to be honest at 77 years old Jesus Christ hurry up but if we got uh, if we got morale of armies and navies from being defender of the faith, I would say yeah, let's do it. But since we're not getting that, I don't think it's worth it. That's unfortunate. Hey, there we go. Finally done. All right. We can turn off encourage development in rum. You can deal with the. Sorani separatists can deal with the Croatian separatists. And we've got Venetian rebels right there. Which we can start moving over. We've got Sunni zealots that are, that are going to spawn here. That we're going to have to deal with. Right, you can go back to drilling then. Where do we have Where do we have black flagged? Oh, they got stuck. That's fine. Let's see here, any others? Papal separatist QQ. March up here for me, please. These land, I think I'm going to, can't encourage development. I need to go to war with Persia. 117,000 troops, motherfucker. Ooh, but it's only Shirvan. You know what? This is a good war for us. So this is what we're doing then instead of, uh, instead of Poland. I would say, unless there's a chance that France doesn't join and there is. There really isn't. Um, being allied to somebody should have better... Uh, should have some sort of malice to joining this war. Because I really need France's help. We're going to keep currying favors with them. back here although I don't remember why I wanted that now 
start marching. You to Shirfan. Start marching you right there. Um, and that's our three, and this is the fourth army that's got to wait. We'll wait one more month. And then we can deal with these rebels. And we just inherited Chunigov. Beautiful. Now let's get you to Rome, please. Grab both of you. Let's get you. Damn. Guess you guys can meet up here. That's probably a fine spot. Um, somebody's gonna want to get or have to get rid of their cavalry as well, so let's just do it with these guys. That'll help because I'm sure we're still over our force limit. We are by six. Uh, which is fine. And just the papal separatists now. Oh fuck, I forgot about the Sunnis. Um, let's just provoke the revolt. Where were you going? You were going to Shirvan. Alright, so come down here. And then go to Shirvan. QQ, Syrian, Hungarian. Come on now, there we go. How much longer till... There we go. Alright. Papal Separatists spawned right here. We've got QQ, Syrian, Hungarian. Where are... They are right there. Alright. What the fuck are you doing? Come on, dude. Seriously. We're off just meeting in Constantinople now, oh, fuck's sake. Um, ba ba ba. Yeah, I guess we can work on moving you there. I just want to deal with these last bit of rebels, but while we wait for them to get up to 50%, I guess we can still. <laughs> Fucking bad at bad luck, Jesus Christ. Got a three siege general of it though, so that's fine. While we're waiting for them to reach fifty percent, we can still at least uh drill, I suppose. Hungarian separatists are actually going down, which I'm fine with. We'll wait one more month just to get them down to zero and then move these guys over. Perfect. Now, move you to. I was gonna say move you to Yerevan. Damn, all these uh, provinces suck. We've got what ninety six thousand right now. Yeah, we need that fourth army. If we're going to go to war with their hundred whatever thousand troops. We can also call in Somalia, that helps. You know, I might just say fuck it and take Shirvan. How much to embrace it now? 2781. So it hasn't gone down at all. Armen. Right here. If this province gets it, it'll bring it down a ton. Unfortunately, it's not even close. Be it. Come back here, still. 
Nothing we can do with the QQ separatists. Um, how much more do we need? Five and three, not eight, but we're going to get rid of a cavalry, so really it's a, a net gain of seven. We're already over by six, so I'm not going to do that. Just able to get there in time. Um, like I got a siege that's beautiful. And honestly, maybe we just say fuck it since. Hey, there's Syria. With that now, we do have a bunch of extra troops, so we're going to get rid of these, and what did I say needed? Five and three. So let's grab five and three. Select you, move you, fuck it, just move you there, move you there, and whoever's not moving is going to get deleted. There we go. So that's another army that we can throw at Persia then. Um, these guys are going to go up to Shirvan. Let's stop drilling. We're going to have to wait a couple months. Expensive edict here, so we'll turn that off. I just want to get a another province, just like one more. Unfortunately... It doesn't look like that's really going to happen. Ooh, right here. Next month. I think. Oh, you dickhead. Okay. Now that it appeared there, we're down to 2743. That didn't really help. Damn, I really thought it was going to help more. Yeah, I think we're better off just embracing it. Fuck it. Oh, wait, great. I didn't realize we were behind on this stuff either. Um, so we can turn off, or I guess just go back to protect trade. And one more month and we can go to war with uh, Persia. Do you have a three siege? You do not have a three siege general. Well, one, we need to get another one, but two, give you this one. So now you should get this, and you can get this. And with that then, I think pretty much ready to go to war. Version successful. Oh, yeah, I don't care. Um, we do also need to build a spy network. So I think we're going to have to wait another month. Uh, no. Because I don't want France's opinion to go lower. Darn, what a horrible time for that guy to die. But I guess we get another one. All right, let's declare war in Persia. Co-belligerent Shirvan calls in Afghanistan. For that one province, I don't care. We can call in Somalia to help, and then war goal can be this one right here. All right, let's go to war. Send you up to Shirvan. And they don't have any forts here. Their next fort is down here in Amol. Well, I 
I guess this guy can just siege the shit down. And this guy can... Uh, why don't you just come here? Ah, just kidding. What a coy. Let's go down to speed 4. Let's send... You out somewhere. Aren't you supposed to be going to port during war? Oh, wait, hang on. And Alexandria, I think, is probably the better one. I don't know, though. Um, bu -bu -bu. Let's transfer... Oh, maybe it should be Crimea instead. Mm, or not. I don't know. Let's just keep going. Shirvan, there's their army wiped out. So now we just need to siege down their fort. And in five days, I'm going to improve with France. Oh shit, I don't know why. Oh, grateful for aid. Cool. Well, never mind then. I'm not going to improve with them. I am, however going to trade favors for trust because I can and I want the extra trust with them boom up to 85 beautiful every time we do this it makes it just a little bit less likely that uh, France is going to help where I can't even see the the reasons or whatever unfortunately these guys are marching down here so I might I might see if I can't snipe 21,000 troops. We'll see. Ah, oh, shit, there's 23,000 now. Where are you going, Tadmore? Staying here. Let me... Fuck. I really need... All of these are fucking... Go sit in our bill. And why don't you come down here with him? Because we are definitely going to want to try to... Snipe these guys wherever possible. Ah, I forgot about Galicia, Bulgaria. How many troops do they have down here? 83, 100. So that's pretty much everybody. I'm going to send this guy here. There's only a two siege guy, though. Fuck. Three siege, three siege. This guy's the other three siege. Very shortly. There we go. Give you this three siege. Give you this two siege. Did I not? Oh, maybe I forgot. What's better? Transfer trade from Persia? Ostrakhan. Let's transfer trade from Ostrakhan. Try that out. How much longer here? Who's got the better general? 4265. Definitely these guys. Fortunately, we're still outnumbered by quite a lot here.
Good, keep running. For 15th and 16th. Let's head in now. Yuja Dagestan is over, that's beautiful. Let's come here. <laughs> Not super peace with them. Super peace with Shirvan. Sixteen aggressive expansion. Holy fuck! Come on. Stack wipe? No, it's not gonna be a stack wipe, unfortunately. Really thought it probably should have been, but hey, whatever. What are you gonna do? We'll come down here though. Might as well keep trying to take out their armies where we can. Now can you get down to Isfahan? You can. Beautiful. Alright, we really need another month of or need a month of repair ticks after this, if we can get it. Ah, fuck. Come on. Stay here. Where to Bill? Just make sure we get it, and then we'll shift consolidate as well. I don't care. You guys can siege that shit down if you want. I don't think I care. National tax. There's absolutism. Ooh, these guys are force marching, and they stopped. Probably smart. Um, I wish they'd come back to that fort. Start marching this way. I might want to pull this army south as well. Potentially. Might as well take out some of these smaller stacks while we have the opportunity to who's this oh the mamluks <laughs> the mamluks own one random province here that's kind of funny damn i forgot about this guy here um ba -ba -ba, you're going this way so that's where i'm gonna go as well and again try to just take out these small stacks Stop moving. Why are we not attached anymore? Uh, yeah, that's a fine spot for you. These guys are looking at being sandwiched together. Come on now. Alright. A twenty-second. A twenty Oh, I can't fucking go that way. Damn it. Well, let's just stay here. Hopefully we win this, please. Come on, 64% we can't win. Seriously? There's Somalia being fucked up. That's fine. Persia wants to waste their manpower in Somalia. They're more than welcome to. There's Isfahan over. Um... Not at war with them. Shirvan finally accepts peace. Um, no, let's move you farther in because we've got these armies here that can siege stuff down. Please win this fucking siege. Come on. Finally, too fucking late though.
<laughs> Fucked yourself, I guess. Come on. That should have been a stack wipe. Come on. Morale of armies and recover morale speed went up, though, so that's good. Where are you going, Baghdad? That's kind of what I thought. Might as well keep going. Somali is sieging that down. Which is more than fine. I need to do something with this army, though. Let's come siege down... Ah, Vaz, I guess. Take out that 2,000. Oh, we'll do that. God damn it. Again, why are we not attached anymore? It's something with... Uh, It's something with going into the Mamluks territory, I bet. I guess... I don't... Never mind. I don't want them to be grouped up anymore. Let's send you up here. I lied. Send you up here. Send you... Send you down here. And you can just stay here. And I guess just siege this stuff down. Um French victory there. Cool cool cool. Eee, hang on, who are we attacking in the mountains? October fifth, October eleventh. Thousand. All right, I can def handle that. Come over here. I lied. It's also mountains. That. Yeah, I want to try to protect this army here while we can. Go down to Samawat. Somalia's got 57,000. How many troops do they have? 129 still? Are you kidding me? Jesus, fuck. You're coming here as well? Ah, shit. Alright, go up there. Take out these 2,000 this that's some of it um these guys should probably try to come up here to be honest i didn't realize uh persia had so many troops still probably makes sense i guess because they had a shit ton of manpower like a hundred five thousand or something when I looked, so they've they're suit way down in manpower at least. Yeah, I couldn't have done anything to help that guy, unfortunately. Let's move you, I guess, to Yazd. on John because you're heading up here um yeah this is all fine I think um I wish I knew where all of their armies were though that's part of the issue because I see 68 70,000 here that still means that there's 56,000 55,000 because there's a thousand right there all right just f for sake of um i want to say completion but that's not the right word just to i guess make sure that we're actually 
sieging everything down behind us. Yeah, see, there's 4,000. Because by sieging down these two provinces, now they're not going to be able to um, recruit troops behind us here. I need you to take Ron, I guess. Ooh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Because we're going to get this. Who's got the better general? Four, two, three, five. Guess I would rather have the four, two in charge. Perfect. Now let's send you to Darab and start sending you down here. You're working your way down to that fort, and they're either going to move off of it. Or take a minus two. So, looks like they are choosing to take the minus two. Um, damn, they got a lot of troops right there, though. Fuck me. Let's see if, nope, they're not going to try to help out at all, which, good for us. Probably a little smart. On their end, but I don't know for sure. And you to Lars stand. How much money are we losing? 30 ducats per month. I bet a big part of it is because we're fucking siege down over here. Stupid fucking France. How much would it hurt our trust and stuff with France if we pieced out of this war? Platin it. Sue for peace. By 10. Uh, I'd rather not do that. So I guess we're just going to accept the fact that we are losing 30 ducats per month. And I guess do this as well. Did we? We did start upgrading that. Good. We've also got Malta upgrading. I'm going to say if it's not done yet, which it is not. So. With our 5,000 ducats, we can at least start looking at, or at least look at building some uh, mini factories to keep our economy growing. I think we're probably going to be done here shortly as well. Kind of out of time. Go to Arbil. I really want to catch up to this 8 stack. And stack wipe them, but I don't know that we're going to be able to going with Sewell. Yeah, we're not going to be able to catch them in Kirkuk. Now maybe we could. Yeah, we're good. Alright, all three of these guys are done as well. Um, gotta capture that fort. So let's send you there and you to Akhfaz to help out and then this guy can just siege down or siege behind us a little bit. Should be a stack wipe and it was beautiful. With the 60,000, I start marching over here and try to come up here because this is where the uh, the one army was retreating to. Instead of going there, do we want to try to go to Basra? I cannot because of this fort. Well, screw it then. Oh my god, finally. We might actually make a little bit of money now. We'll see. <laughs> no, we're still losing 30 ducats. Well, then the, uh, uh, the next big culprit that I can think of would be the uh, reinforcement that we have to do of our armies. And we just got, I would say, I thought it was tier 7, and I was right. So, we'll do this and then we'll end the episode. So, what do we want to take? Admin free policies, tolerance of the true faith, don't give a shit. Nobles of the robe, giving us leader cost minus 10, also don't care. 
This one gives advisor costs and yearly corruption. Not too bad. This one gives us dynastic administration. So yearly corruption goes up. But our monarch admin skill also goes up. Um, Definitely not doing that one. What do we need for this one? If we finished court ideas, we could take this. Um, ah, the maximum absolutism would kind of be nice. But court's kind of shit. Diffle reputation, power projection from insults, don't care. Uh, state's loyalty equilibrium goes up. Not. Eh, I don't know. It's all right. Yearly prestige is all right. Reform progress, growth. Um, yeah, none of this, none of that's good. That is a terrible, terrible idea, I think. Maybe in certain situations it would be good, but not with anything we've got. So, I guess we're going to do the, uh, meritocratic recruitment for the minus 10% advisor costs and the little bit of yearly corruption reduction. Let's just take Akhvaz. Perfect. Alrighty, guys. With that, we are going to be out of time. If you guys enjoyed the episode, go ahead and click the like button. Don't forget to click the subscribe button as well. New content every day at 12 noon Eastern time. And we'll see you again next time.